Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be unboxing Monster Fairs Cleo. Here she is. I was not planning on getting her, but I saw her in the shop and guys, she looks she looks so pretty and the side glance. I think this is like my only two three dollar side glance if I'm correct because um I just I'm sure there's another one that I wanted, but I don't think it came to the UK. Maybe I'm losing my mind, I don't know. But here's the back of the box anyway. Personally, I don't really like the layout of this. The main like is actually like the dolls, like the, you know, characters aren't like the main focus, but that's just me being that picky, I think. <laughs> so, yeah. But I do like the new box design. Isn't it neat, guys? Yeah. Yeah, let's nod. But yeah. <laughs> So I'm gonna take her out of the box and also before I say anything else, doesn't she like scream like Kesha? Maybe because I've been listening to like uh, like too much Kesha recently, but I don't know guys. She's <laughs> she's kinda giving off some Kesha impressions right now. But yeah. Um I've also got like two short clips of when I was in the shop picking her out or whatever. So I will click quickly, quickly add those in. And when I've done that, I'll be back and she'll be at the box. So yes. You can meet me at my hotel With nothing on and be a trench coat She just does. Also, the song Animals by Maroon 5. Yeah, <laughs> that's what she's also giving in this moment. We will take a look at her r right now, and then I will show her accessories quickly after I show her off, because she is the main attraction here, guys. Well, let's just get right into it. <laughs> so here we have her shoes. I wish they had more painted details, like on the box. I wish they were painted, because they are so cute. Um, Really cool mold, because like, if this was gold and I was maybe gold, it would have been so perfection, you know, but, um, I guess we can live without her, uh, we, we'll move, we'll move, I guess, but yeah, um, we also have her trousers, which are, like, um, obviously not full length, so you still see her mummy wraps, um, she has her big belt, which is obviously a big separate piece, I'll show without the belt, because I'm kind of curious how the outfit looks, oh, I like that popping noise, <laughs> but I did not even know she had elastic band on her, um, just take that off. This is the outfit without it, which you know what, it still kind of looks cute. I, I, it's still cute. Um, the belt definitely, I think, could have been painted a little more, but um, we can we can move on, I suppose, from that. But uh, a little painted detail would have been nice. <laughs> Please, Mattel, can we paint a little more details on these dolls once in a while? Let's stop being lazy here. Um, <laughs> anyway. Um, she also has her little, like, gold, like, shimmery top thing. I don't know what you'd call this. Jacket, I guess. <laughs> I actually really like it. I think it's, like, tacky and, and like, a really nice way, if that makes any sense. Um, like I said, it's, like, in a Kesha way, you know? And I quite like Kesha, if you can't tell. I've been listening to her a lot recently. But, yeah. Um, she has this little, like, necklace piece, I think. Is it a necklace? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. Um, we also have her earrings, which are just little bugs. There we go. And oh, look at her makeup. Oh, look at her side glance. This, this is the Cleo face I need. And look at the hair. It's so long. We've got a bit of tinsel in it and not too much where it's like annoying. She doesn't have any hairstyle in it. It's just like middle part down. But you know what? I can go with. It's actually, and it is Saran, in case anyone is wondering. G3 doll with Saran. Since when, guys? OMG! <laughs> she also has this headpiece, which is actually so cute. I quite like it. It's like a bit of a twist on the typical flower crown. I like it. But the painted details are um, a little pixelated. Maybe that's why they refuse to do more painted stuff. Oh, wait. Is that Mark Mint to be on it? I don't... Uh, guys. Uh, guys. Okay, if you know that audio, I'm doing that right now. I, I might try to add it. But, like, I don't think it's why we like that. I might Google that. BRB, guys. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm pretty sure those marks aren't meant to be on it, and it won't come off. I tried to get it off a little bit there. Um, but you know what? At least it's not her face. <laughs> uh, let's quickly look at her accessories, though, because they are quite cute. I'll, I'll give them that for a change. 
So first up, we have these two old, like, bracelets. You got a little ticket. Wait, no, are these just a roll of, like, tickets? No, these, does wait, you put on a rest. Oh, wait, no, it's, like, no, okay. <laughs> I'm so stupid. This is, like, a rest thing to, like, get into, like, monster face or whatever it is. Um, then we have a bracelet. Cute. I might put them on her. We also have the string, which is actually really cute. Like, look, you can take the little top off. I actually, oh, it's got little bubbles in it, too. Can you guys see that? That's actually cute. I, I, I like the drink, actually. <laughs> Um, we also have this, like, what is this? It's a ticket. Yep. A nice blurry ticket. Um, abnormally large, too. We also have this, like, Polaroid camera. Cute. <laughs> and I think it's the last thing. Oh, wait, no, I think there's more. I need to get it in a minute. And we also have this bag, which horribly pixelated, but it's cute. Fabric would have been nice, too, but I'll take what I can get when it comes to Mattel. So yeah, and here are her glasses. They're neat. I think they're meant to be like bug, slay bug wings. And the final accessory is this kebab meat, I think it is. Yeah, meat and a stick, we'll call it that. But yes, this is most of Ice Cleo guys. That is, I think everything she came with, I don't think I missed anything unless I'm like blind and because I keep finding things in the box when I was taking stuff out of it, so, well, obviously I did, but, like, <laughs> I was about to go bin it, so let's hope I didn't bin anything important. Well, to be fair, I don't really think this is all that important, um, but, yeah, <laughs> I think the other doll from this line I quite like, to be fair, I saw Claudine in person, Claudine was nice, and, and I really love Laguna, I think Cleo and Laguna are actually my favourites from G3, and maybe Dracula, but Dracula has had some pretty bad dolls too. But I think Cleo and Laguna are definitely my favourites. Same for like G1, to be honest. They are my favourites from G1. They are just so precious. I love them so much. <laughs> so yes, this was Monster Fest Cleo. And thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you have a great day and bye!